What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Brady Tone. In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing you guys how to use cheat codes or the cheat engine on the Ryu Jinx emulator. Before we get started this video, please make sure you guys leave a like, share, and also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Let's get it. Now, first things first, everything you guys will need will be in the description down below from cheats and the cheat engine itself. So make sure you guys get those two applications and as you follow along the video, it will be much more simpler because you already have everything already. You already have everything you already need. Now, this is very um, game dependent, as you guys may know. Cheat engine. Uh, it it works around a specific games. Like say, for example, if you need want to use cheat codes for Pokemon Sword and Shield, you're gonna need uh, the cheat sheet for Pokemon Sword and Shield, and also a cheat engine, obviously. So as you guys see. Okay, so you guys, this cheat engine. Um, this is the main website. Uh, you should download the latest version as, uh, as soon as you press download cheat engine, you can get you the latest version. And then after that, when you get to this website, this is basically um, a more up to date um, cheat sheet for Pokemon Sword and Shield. This is um, Sword Pokemon Sword Pacific. I don't know if he has um, for shield, but I know he has for sword. I'll also leave this in the description down below. And how basically how Cheat Engine works is obviously gonna open up Cheat Engine. Right. And then when you're right here, you're gonna open up this. You're gonna do it for the Ryu Jinx emulator. And after you do that, you're gonna open up um, the folder and look for Pokemon Sword. That pops up quick. It pops up. Pop stuff. <laughs> it pop up very quickly. You're gonna open up that, and that's pretty much it. That's how you basically work Cheat Engine. And then, as you know, it works for um, Ryu Jinx and Yuzu. I believe it has a money uh, enable money cheat. I think this has a randomizer. I'm not too sure. It has certain Pokemon you can follow more, so I believe we use it in the DLCs. A lot of Pokemon follow you. And obviously, other things are locked due to the fact that they only work when you're playing the game. And also, another cool thing about this cheat engine for Pokemon Sword is that you can enable the speed hack. So when you're playing the game, you basically can enable it. Obviously, it's not going to work now because I'm not showing gameplay, but honestly, I cannot show gameplay due to the fact that if I do show gameplay, Nintendo will basically claim this video. That's what they do with most of my emulation videos, so I'm not trying to risk it today. So I'd rather explain how this thing works. It's pretty simple and easy. It's something straight to the point, not something too complex. So when you're playing the game, you can obviously enable the speed hack, and then it was, you can go all the way to zero, which obviously freezes the game, and it goes up to 400, I believe which is really uh, fast but for that to work very accurately because it's not at the point that it works 100 percent gotta have um a lot of your things tabbed closed out because you're gonna use a lot of your ram and a lot of your gp as funny as that sounds so make sure everything is basically um closed in your tabs and a lot of applications a lot of applications has to be closed and also how these other things work is when in, when you're um, in the gameplay, you just double click it and it should work. So if something doesn't work, it's probably a bug, it needs another update, it needs to be fixed, but most things should work uh, from my experience. So that's basically much it. That's how you use cheat codes so far on the Ryu Jinx emulator. You gotta use cheat engine and then basically all good to go so that's basically about it if you guys enjoyed this video feel free to like share also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel and yeah guys this is your boy break i'll see you guys in the next video peace out